and now it's time to install Max OWS package and configure it um, uh, to our project. So after that, we are going to build a backend for our phone end. So basically, what we need here is uh, well, search for Max OWS. And this is the introduction documentation, and there is the installation process. So, uh, if you are using the yarn, uh, what uh, do this uh, with the yarn add? And if you are uh, using the npm, just use npm install. So we need to grab this, and we are our terminal. Um, right. Mm -hmm. So it should. Uh, install the Nuxjs out next uh, into the our project. Let's just wait a bit. Yeah, that's it. And inside the uh, Nuxjs Nux config.js file, uh, we need to add some settings to our out uh, module. So uh, I've already did this, and we'll just mm, copy and paste it here mm, uh, under the uh, Axios. Uh, so uh, basically, the uh, Max OS uh, package comes with uh, some uh, pre-built uh, strategies uh, for the managing managing the authentication process, and we are going to use this uh, local st uh, strategy with <coughs> refresh scheme. Uh, in order to store these uh, tokens in the local storage, we are going to use this prefix OS dot. So everything is going to be OS dot access token and uh, the the lo login strategy itself so if you did not get this uh, yet just d uh, do not panic so we will mm, come back to this and tune a bit uh, for storing the access token for storing the refresh token uh, this is for the we don't need this comments this is for getting the user from the backend and we have uh, some endpoints these endpoints uh, uh, are not uh, on, uh, in the front side. So if you remember, we have in the front as a slash login. But this is for backend. So uh, imagine that there's uh, some links and localhost, API v1 and slash login. Uh, this will, uh, when you uh, log, uh, when you try to log in with uh, our next package, it's going to uh, send the request, the method post, post request to this login. And when you want to uh, get the to refresh token, and when you want to refresh the access token, uh, uh, you need to send this token refresh endpoint, the post request to this endpoint. And if you want to get uh, the logged in user, uh, you need, mm, it's going to do uh, the trick automatically. Uh, so we don't need, uh, we don't need to do something, uh, something else. Here, yeah, uh, uh, this is a method get to, uh, to get the logged in user. This is a logout. We are sending the post request to this logout endpoint, and it will uh, it will log out. So this is the basic uh, settings for our the OS Max OS package, and of course we need to add some base URL in the Axios. Uh, but we will come back to this uh, to this thing uh, after building uh, some backend to our login process. Yeah, that's it for uh, for the preparing our front end side. Uh, check, let's just quickly check if it's not uh, going to crash. Nope, nice. So it started. Uh, let's uh, see you in the next video, and we are going to start for uh, from our backend. Yeah, bye.